Hello everyone, and welcome back to some Sky Factory 4. For those of you watching on YouTube, this is gonna be the reveal for the prank setup that was hopefully the previous video. We are gonna go back to the Twilight Forest and everyone's all decked out and really repaired this time around, so pretty cool. But we're gonna start things off by showing them the prank. So in order to do this, we are gonna need to cheat a little bit. So uh, I know, I know, a lot of people are gonna be like really hurt and sad. So I'm actually going to, and also chat will be seeing this, the very first people will be watching this in uh, stream. So I know some people are gonna be kind of bummed out about that, but don't worry, you're not too far behind. All right. Let me go ahead. All right, everyone close your eyes, please. Artie, I'll grab you first. I'm already here. Oh, okay, just kidding. I'm not gonna grab Artie first. All right, close your eyes, close your eyes. Dearth to Choco, the Chocobo. And then text to Choco, the Chocobo. Okay, count of three. Three, two, one, look. Welcome to Ooh, our new fancy. base base. Wow. So. This whole thing is going to be, oh, what? Why is, why is it on? Why is it on? Okay, hold on. Oh. Wait a minute. I thought you did that. Yeah, I must have whenever I was testing some stuff. Um, yeah, but welcome to the new framework for the new base. Uh, this thing, I will go over some of the features really briefly. I know for those of you who watched the prank video, obviously this will be some old news, but uh, hopefully it will be pretty darn cool. Oh, wait, did you hit the button already? No, no, I'm far away. Oh, someone hit the button and then Oh. That was weird. It's probably okay. text. No, it's, I didn't it's, probably, text it's probably an update buttons. issue. I think it might have been an update issue. Button. All right, so um, I'll let that run for a little bit so it actually fixes itself. So welcome to currently working name is the Golden Compass because it's very directionally based. This is going to be operating. What's going on here? Why are you being dumb? Wait a minute. Uh, Hold on, guys. I'm trying to I'm figure out. I'm always dumb. Did someone? Or is, <laughs> and for sure, no one's messing with that button. No. Okay. I am incredibly Maybe. confused. Uh, okay. This one click. I'm going to take a gander at this. Okay, anywho. So, Golden Compass, directionally based. Kind of a neat little thing. Goes on the same exact principles of what we had as the original idea for how we're going to run the base. Um, on the very top level here, we're going to eventually have a two locations on all four sides so you can access the crafting stuff and whatever else. But this is actually just meant to kind of be like a place to look over and kind of gather around for. Also has like a little fountain-esque feel to it when the water is on. You may have noticed I can turn the water on and off, which is kind of neat. Um, if you go down just a little bit underneath, you'll see that in this like little cup part, you can actually come up in here. And you'll see that this has like an internal area. There's like a little pool of water here. So if you ever need to kind of get some stuff done, because um, eventually this will probably be where we house some of the processing units for AE2. Then you can also hang out here. You can fish a little bit or you can do whatever you need. Heading on downward to the very bottom level, this is gonna be kind of like our central point. Um, these things of water should go away whenever I turn off the water stream, assuming that the block updates aren't crazy. But if, assuming that everything goes correctly, then they should stop, the water curtains will go away, and this will just turn into an open area. Um, this will also have all the terminals for A2, but we're obviously not there yet, but whenever we get them, that will be ready as well. Each of the corners will be a productivity side, so you know how we have like machines and like Tinker's Construct, and it's just kind of a cluster of mess. Um, we're gonna probably end up putting machines and Tinker's here. I think for Miskel Agriculture and Bonsai's, I'm gonna put them somewhere else so like text doesn't lag and I don't have to worry about anything either. So it should be pretty cool. And then on the major cardinal directions, just like we had in the original area, we will have our respective areas to build bases. Um, so if you like would like to make your house and stuff, I would say go ahead and start working on it here. And I think that's perfectly fine with flying, of course. This is much more practical. So well, I'm anyways. Glad I didn't build mine yet. Huh? I'm glad I didn't build my house yet. Yeah, so this should be a pretty, this, this should be a better framework that's a little bit better spaced out 
it should also make a little bit more sense in terms of how to get everything else to work. As of right now, if you lose your ability to fly and you want to like operate out of here, you will have to climb up the water streams. Um, I will be adding I'm in- I'm coming up. Huh? That I'm never getting up. Well, yeah, but I'm gonna be adding in other things as well to help kind of facilitate uh, movement here and junk like that. But for right now, this is the framework for where, like what the rest of the base will be. Um, and then we'll add things as we go along. But for right now, I think this is going to be fine. So uh, I don't expect us to migrate just yet. I think that we'll finish Twilight Forest and then uh, we'll start getting into some automation machinations. But whenever we get into those parts, especially whenever it comes to the machinery and stuff and automation, I do, I would certainly appreciate the help. And not only would I appreciate the help, but I think it'll also make a lot of sense for us to all understand how it mechanically works. So we can always, you know, work and use it to our advantage rather than just being like we have to wait for so and so to get on in order for this to happen <laughs> because i think that is a uh, not too bad and yes i also have heard especially from Artie, that this reminds him of the uh the daily planet or whatever superman's news agency is fortresses it looks like fortress of solitude what there's no well, ice here i'm thinking of the the daily planet because it has the globe oh on top yeah, yeah with the yeah, I can see it. With a mix of Sears Tower. Yeah. This is yeah. the fortress of friendship, not solitude. Please. I don't know. To me, it kind of reminds me, if you look on the mini-map, Skull and Crossbones. <laughs> so I like that. No, there is no Skull and Crossbones here. I do not wish to promote death. <laughs> even well, really. I mean... There is a... Community. Wait, hold on, hold on. There is one rule. <laughs> there will be other rules, I'm sure, added as people find inventive ways to give grief... <laughs> But there is one hard and set rule for this whole thing. Do not place any of Dearth merchandise around, <laughs> AKA those dolls, or anyone's merchandise doll form anywhere. Please do not put dismembered heads all around, especially on pikes. Do not have things that are just purely <laughs> there for trolling purposes or that will lag this area down. Now, while right now it's okay, I do expect that as we add machinery and stuff, things will get a little bit rougher, but the reason why I'm gonna probably separate out the uh, mystical agriculture and the bonsais is because if we end up doing that here, I think it's gonna lag down eventually because it's just too much in one area. So I'm gonna probably try to compactly like make a farming area and then just let it run outside of where we operate. But yeah. <clears throat> it's very <coughs> space station-y, I like it. Yeah, it's, I, I think it's- I was wondering when you were gonna go full well, so this is like the first part of it, but I think that it's gonna be more fun to work on the rest of it. I just wanna make the framework for this. Um, also, it's bright. So for the people who complain about this all the time, it's bright, okay? Are you happy now? But uh, yeah, should be all good. Also, quite clear glass, which was when the Tinker's Construct, this thing is really clear, so. Yeah, I tried to fly up it already. <laughs> um, oh, and that I actually did that as well. I was basically a Windex commercial. Um, <laughs> these gates as well you can kind of customize them to your liking I just have them set up in such a way so everyone has like the same exact starting point so you can leave them as is or you can go ahead and customize them however you want behind the initial glowstone that's on the side that's facing the center um, there is a mega torch so if you see like little smoke things popping up that's because mega torch is inside there blocking creep and mob spawns every now and again we will see Android spawn as they don't seem to respect uh, mob spawn logic so just a little heads up, but yeah. So you can see right here, like the water curtain retracted. Pretty cool. And but. he did us a favor this time. We are not on one. We can actually go under the thing. Yep. So if we need to build slightly down in our builds, we actually can. Yep. Nice. And there's nothing that prevents you, like I didn't give you a whole lot of verticality downward, but I gave you enough that if you do need to build something underneath, you can certainly do that. Um, I think building it vertically will look nicer just because it will look more impressive to have like larger things around. So I think this is pretty fun. But anywho, um, yes, for those of you who are wondering, mystical agriculture and uh, bonsai stuff will not be here. They'll be located off site. The mob farm, I think, um, we're gonna leave at the old base and I'll probably just tinker around with a little bit of the settings there. Uh, fusion reactor and the things that we need to make the fusion reactor work. If I do ever update it slash make a new system for it, I'm gonna do it a little bit differently anyway. So that's that should cover everything. 
So but. this is in the regular world, right? So I can go ahead and set a home. Yep. Thing here. Yep. Okay. You can. You can. I, what I do is I put it in the Ender Book and I added a thing for this. Um. Also, if you so desire, you can also. Uh, oh, not if you so desire. If you if you are uh, not careful, if you're near the mob farm and the old base, be careful because your Ender Books actually operate using the Ender Pearl system. So if you attempt to ender book near the ender inhibitor, you can't warp, but it will take your experience. And because oh. if you look at the coordinates, we're at negative 40,000 pretty much. It's really far. So this will gobble up your experience. It is very possible that you'll get stranded here. So just be careful. Um, <laughs> I would, I personally would recommend that you not start migrating over until we've gotten the machinations and stuff ready and automation ready here. And then we can start to move things over and start building here. But for right now, I think it'll be perfectly fine just to just to kind of roll with what we got. And yeah, like right here, we have a couple of androids, Dave and whatever is underneath, Mega Man. Is it Buster? No. You see, that is what I like about uh, AE and refined storage. The entire process of moving, we can just break everything, throw it into a disk drive, and move it all at one time. Yep, yep. Yeah, I'm also pretty so pleased about the filing cabinets, too, because I think the filing cabinets actually will work pretty well for storage. Yes, they will. <clears throat> okay. Well, I am impressed. Thank you also, by the way, Llama, for the hundred of cheer. Appreciate that. Appreciate you. Um, all right. Anywho, so enough jabbering on. Let me warp us back to our actual base. Um, I'll warp you guys, courtesy of cheats, real quick. Well, I'm already back, so. Well. Oh, okay. Uh, it only used three levels. Yeah, I was about to test it. Well, you can That's if you look at your Ender Book, it'll actually tell you how much experience it'll take if you just hover over it. Um, remember, oh. remember though that the experience, oh. the higher your level, the more experience that exists within that level. So levels like 300 to 301 is immensely higher than level one to two. Oh, 3,092. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So eh, even still, I mean, 100 levels, that'll. We can get there and back up a couple times. Yeah, I'm just cautioning everyone because I know that some people will be like, oh, well, should be fine. Also, you know, account for a round trip. Don't, you know, LOL run through and then be like, wait a minute. It might be good to set up a little experience gatherer. Yeah, we do. Just for this is the other thing. So come over to the mob farm. <laughs> good luck, Dex. <laughs> Where be dearth? I'm here. Come uh, up. So, real quick, a little tutorial explanation thing. Fluid, uh, the filing cabinet, the fluid filing cabinet, the way that these are made is you make a filing cabinet, you give it a fluid upgrade from filing cabinet, or real filing cabinet mod, and they'll change it to this color once you apply it. Once you've done that, you can put fluid folders in here, they'll collect fluid, and they will collect it basically infinitely. <clears throat> You'll notice that there's an item frame on top with a bucket of experience. The way that this works is that basically it doesn't understand that it's supposed to filter from its list and like choose an item or a liquid to move out. So the way that it does it is you put an item frame above it and then you put the bucket of a liquid, whatever you're trying to move, into that frame and it'll look at that and say, okay, that's what I need to move. This is then linked to the cyclic experience pylon. And this one you can go ahead and just withdraw experience from. And you can just gather experience that way. So we can actually, you know, use our experience for the first time in a while. But oh. a little bit of a simplifying, simpler way of making the experience work for us. Um, I will be working on a better way for things to work generally because I'm not entirely happy with how our systems are right now. But now that we have an actual base area framework that should be able to accommodate machines and stuff, I think that things will get a little bit better. Well, um, I am not lagging at all over here. Yeah. So, a uh, quick question: Did you, so you, when you were building, besides the androids non-stop spawning, uh, how about slimes? I have seen a couple of slimes, but they were also during the time whenever the mob spawn logic was broken. So I do not know what the current status is of that. Okay. Um, I have not noticed. I think during the time that we were there, for example, nothing was spawning. Slimes tend to spawn here regardless of what's going on pretty frequently but I, I have not seen evidence of slime spawning there yet during the normal time. 
But that's not to say that they won't, because let's be serious, it's me we're talking about here. It's probably I found a mystical land where we're going to have like 900 like really angry Endermen that are only going to pick up blocks and do absolutely nothing else and just throw them into the void. But uh, yeah, all right, cool. So sorry to take us out of everything. Let's go ahead and let's knock out the rest of Twilight Forest, shall we? Yeah, and it's definitely the trees. If I even look at the trees, I have issues. So Yeah, it's just a lot of things loading all the time. Okay. All right, Upstairs. well, I'll see you guys over there. Just kidding, I should have done that. I need to go back. <laughs> oh, I thought you went to the we nether. <laughs> okay, hold on. We need to go back. I forgot to bring the map. map yes let me confirm cool please don't <laughs> I, I so thought you were close. challenging us <laughs> no you were I'm looking at me like you wanted to fight i'm just trying to get some hearts back there we go uh, uh, okay. typical titan behavior i thought you were trying to pick a fight <laughs> no you sure yeah you positive yeah he sure. was looking at me funny okay <laughs> Oh, no, no, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to touch it. Go away. What? Acid rain? <laughs> no, black hole. Ah. Okay, so where we left off, um, we just need to go ahead and head back on over to uh, the little labyrinth thingy that existed. The um, prison or the labyrinth? The labyrinth thing, because you, you, you got the quest thing, but if you can explain what you saw and how you got it. Oh, yeah. Because remember, you yeah you already completed the quest area, so we I don't really know what was entailed in that, but he, he did he did a thing. Yeah, by accident. So <laughs> he he accidentally I, beat an entire boss area. No problem. He slipped was, and fell, and then was like, "Oh, sorry, did I did I kill you? My my fault. I didn't mean to murder you and your entire family." But so when I went in, um, I was testing the oh hello. Oh, cool. I was testing the uh, upgrades to my weapons, and I went into one room. I got attacked by a bunch of stuff. Uh, they were... You remember how when we were, get, we were in there, we were getting attacked by the two things on top of each other? Like, the uh, they were the knights, and they had the little... Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, thanks for destroying it. Uh, what? <laughs> Wait, did you need any of this? No. No, but I'll leave those with you because they're your friends. I hate <laughs> silverfish. Infernal so, demon spawn. It was the little knight things, but when I killed them... The little short ones? Yeah, but they had the things on top of it. I thought that's what they were, but it turns out that they were actually normal boss mobs. So ah. I got the head and stuff like that from them. Uh, also, there are hidden chests in here inside some of these things. Um, Ow. Animal squirrel. Trying to... Oh, I found a chest inside some stuff. Oh, I found a, uh, yeah. a some blue wool. Oh, nice. We need that. And an oh. armor shard. Oh, get away from me, Creeper. Creeper, stop laughing at me. Oh, this pickaxe is so, glorious. Is there chests are hidden inside the pot lines? Yeah. yeah but the ones standing by themselves. Uh, like that one? Found another one. No, Someone's taking thing. immense amounts of damage. Is that one of uh, us that's taking damage right there? Uh, oh. Ooh. I heard an explosion. Yep. Apparently they're trapped. I killed a bunch of stuff, but I didn't take any damage. I'm taking damage right now, but it's all good. <laughs> Who needs trophies when you can just break all the blocks? Killed yeah, it was in... Goblin Knight there. Ow. Wait, yeah. is this bat hitting me? Oh, wait, no, I'm just starving to death. Okay, never mind. We're good. 
Oh, I found a goblin knight. Oh, I found... Okay. So you kill one of these guys for the boss thing? Well, no. The ones that had people on top of them. Ow. What's hitting me? Oh, the slime buggy. Um, so, yeah. Like, one of those. I thought it was one of... But it was actually a completely different one. It just kind of looked like that. And I'll try mm. to find it again because this is a different prison. Ha ha ha. Who is ha 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 he 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 me? Oh. These crabs are giving me horrible flashbacks to Subnautica. Oh. Get away, little goblin. -y. Oh, okay, this one's like a merged knight. Is that the one I'm supposed yes, to be murdering? So, yeah, so it looked like one of those, and then when I killed it, it dropped a head. Okay. Ow. Yeah, it's like the upper knight and the lower knight combined. Right. Yeah, okay. And so it looks like it was like one of those, but like I said, it acted different. Uh, I got wheat. Oh, that's Choco. All right. <laughs> Yeah, let's ah. not try to kill me. <laughs> yeah, I almost swung at you. It's a natural reflex. Well, Still don't think that's supposed to be a natural reflex. <laughs> I know you guys are trying to, like, you know, make that a thing, but it's, I don't think that's really a thing. <laughs> you don't think so, but it's its like the Quay Way. No! 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 <laughs> <laughs> We're bad at aiming, and we, we kill Choco. No! Yeah, that's, that sounds about right. No! Bad, bad titans, bad. I mean, haven't been proven wrong yet. I am a quay. I myself am one. I do not wish to hurt myself. There is no do, though, so well. <laughs> I can't argue with this point. It's kind of insulting. <laughs> oh, Interesting. To death as well. Okay, well... I didn't get a head from the one I killed. Uh, there, you'll run into a room that has a bunch of them. Keep on running into those like, like they're merged together and then I just kind of slap them to death and kind of go about my business. They are on the lower level though, yeah? Uh, oh, I almost fell in that hole. Well, you have the power of flight techs. Yeah, but I still get scared because I fall off everything, even with the light. Okay, I killed a block and chain goblin. Okay, I'm getting out of here. Oh, I found lava. Take a, a swim. lot of lava. It's just a room full of lava and ores. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, maybe that's it. There's a giant tower next to us. Oh, I don't want to go there. Oh, here's a creeper. Come here, creeper. So very spooky dark. Um, so then what do I do with this room, Marty? Uh, well, if it's the room, I think, you go in and kill everything. It's just lava. There's nothing, like, in there. There's nothing. Lava. <laughs> <laughs> and, and a little bit of lava. So there's nothing else? There's it's just a big flat floor of lava? Yep. Oh, well. Okay. Oh, I found a chest. No, you couldn't have, because it's just a flat floor of lava. Oh no, I'm I'm next to it now. Ah. Got some blue wool. I'm in, we need blue wool. I'm in what I can only assume is like a mess hall or something. Okay, this room is really weird. This dungeon is weird. I don't really like it. <clears throat> okay, so I'm in the hallway. Ha <laughs> ha ha! Yes! Oh, I found a bunch of pumpkins on wood planks. I'm back to where I was. Oh. Ah! Okay, I'm gonna well, go ahead. Thanks. I can verify that the lava burns. <laughs> I'm going to head southeastward to the, to another one of those. Have you dug through this stuff already? Uh, no. But, and if we find it, I'll, I'll call you Choco. 
Okay, I'm gonna look over here and see if I can find one. Are they are they distinctive looking or not really? Uh, nope. Like I said I thought it was just in a normal room, just it was slightly different. No, like the mob. Oh, uh, not that I recall. Okay, so there's nothing inside this thing. It just looks like it's a bunch of ore. All right, here, Dex. Wait, did these guys put down TNT? What? Dex, over here. Uh, Let me yeah. show you the, uh... So, it was looking like this. Oh, yeah, 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 I found one. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, and already I found this lava by coming out. If you just dig out and fly, find the lowest point. Because I thought that's what you wanted us to find was the lowest point. No, we want to find the dungeon boss. Oh, wow. It's lava underneath this thing, too. How is the lava staying there? Uh, lack of block updates? Yeah, just underneath. It's just a solid floor of lava. Oh, dear. All this uh, is the server stuff. lagging or something? What's going on? Yeah, I'm uh, getting... Oh, oh, oh no. Ah. Oh, yeah, those guys 100% put down uh, TNT. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> those guys are cool. Oh, another lava room. I will find my way. What is this? Rock crystal ore. Hmm. Ooh, what are these? Fireflies? Yeah, I can see. Hello, slimes. Good day. Okay, a bunch of regular vanilla mobs. A lot of regular vanilla mobs. Uh, I found I found a room, oh. but I think it's in a, it's in a different one. What? Seven forty four, negative five ten. Describe the room. Uh, has a bunch of the upper lower nights, and then there's some I don't know some weird uh, her, uh, helmet crabs. Yeah, I'm fighting some of those right now. Oh, I found a lava room in this area, too. It has a lot of, like, valuable ore on top. Too bad it's not really that valuable for us, but... Yeah. Oh, I found a place that's, like, walled off. Oh, maybe that's it. Yes, 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 go in there. Okay, yep. I see a spawner. I see what looks like... A, it lo oh, it spawned a whole bunch of ghosts! Uh, uh, come to Choco, eight... No, what, what am I? Eight. Is that an eight or is that a six? Can't tell. Cry. What's my coordinate? Right, I gotta find a way out of here. No creeper. Six. Okay, so I'm at 666. Really? Okay. Uh, and then 53 Zed. If you... I'll, I'll be up above. So if you go, let me see here. So from the dungeon that you guys are at, head southeast, you'll find another sprawling dungeon and then go follow that dungeon to the western part of it. And I'll be there. Okay, so south, go east. South. east. Oh, east, not south, okay. No, that's west. Go west, Artie, west. West. All right, just six. Uh, How am I no. digging into obsidian? That's the opposite way. We gotta go west, not east. Wait. 666. It's like right here. Oh, you're right over here. He's in a different one. Yeah, he's right over here. He's just n right next to us. Okay, so, so head now. south, Tex. Just ignore Choco's recommendation. Oh, south? Okay. What? Yeah. 
What? Why did he ignore my recommendation? What? You had us flying off into space. Southeast. Mm-hmm. What? You're gonna what? fly south. Here, there you are, Tex. Over here. Oh, turn to your left. Now turn to your right. Now, okay, look, look down. There yeah. Yep. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. See, see, Tex was flying like way over there because your direction. What? Okay. Just go southeast. <laughs> Not that hard. Oh. Wait, 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 southeast. What? Oh, I thought you let him out. No. All right, let's go in. Let's go clobber some people. So what are these things called? Night phantoms. Okay, well, the night phantoms didn't really give me anything. Oh, it's a big boy. Oh, and he's he's really mean big boy. Did anything oh, happen? I get to attack him. Yeah, check the, check oh, the chest. Oh, yep. Knight Phantom Trophy. Ooh, Phantom nice. Plate is never lost on death. The Knightly Sword, extra damage to armor targets with insight. Knightly Pick, or extra XP for mobs and blocks. Oh, this thing has like smelting and stuff on it too. Yeah, there's Knightly Axe. Soulbound. Protection, protection and breaking. So these ones are not that great. All right, cool. So we've knocked out yet another part. Oh, it's surrounded by obsidian as well. Cheeky. Wait, 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 wait. So I was there on the other one. Because I was oh. digging through obsidian. Then yeah, you should have just gone to the side. Well, I dug through the obsidian and flew out. <laughs> yeah, in case you're on the wrong side. Okay. Okay, right. cool. So let's take a gander here. Nope, that's the wrong thing. Um, <clears throat> Twilight Forest, we have now beaten down a knight. Cool, so we have settled the Restless Phantoms of the Knight's Tomb and the Carmenite Tower's devices will obey you. And now we have one thing called Mystery Meat. It looks like cake, though. And then something else that says, Something strange in Towerwood. Slay the Carmenite Gaslings around a gas trap and activate to wrench the Urgas from the sky. So kill Gaslings around a gas trap. Then activate it okay. to okay. So we're heading. I just saw one. We're heading not too far. We're heading north. To yep, the north. There it is. is this it? Yep, I do believe so. There's a black hole there. Um, that's up. What are we doing? Uh, there are gas Hello? shooting. I can't see anything. Can't oh. see anything. Okay, these are called gas guards, which is weird. I'm blind. Yeah, what? I can't go near it. Oh, wait, 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 yeah, hold on. Uh, retreat, retreat. Go back south, 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 south. Uh, okay. I'm go back to up. the maze thing. Uh, okay. Oh, oh you need to pick up that thing? Yeah. Here, I'm going to drop the trophy so everyone can touch it. North text from your oh, position. I got to kill a squirrel right quick. No, don't kill a squirrel. Okay, there we go. Where are you? <laughs> back back where, where we were. were. What's Texas wrong with the squirrels? Texas butchering his It was looking at me. Then toss that that's... on the dearth whenever he gets here. Yep. Oh, There's right. dearth right that's on. That's Texas way of uh, saying Evie should stream more. Or LV. <laughs> okay, cool. Alright, now let's try that again. To the north! Alright. Yeah, that was do horrible. We, do we have to place the trophy? I don't believe so. I didn't have to do anything. I'm not blind. Oh, yeah, but uh, it's still I'm dark. Getting... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Run away, run away. Wait, it's still oh, dark there's... for you? Yeah, it's like you're going into a... a... You're just getting blindness, I guess. No, it's like you're going into seaweed. You see all these strands, and then all of a sudden, it goes completely dark. Oh, yeah. you're in that weird barrier. Um. Wait, open your achievement books. So open up your inventory. It's advancements in the top right. right. And then go to Twilight Forest, the furthest right tab, and then you should look down and then not the very top row but on the right like underneath the and now find the exit see if you have carmenite acclamation it's like oh, this is a, looks so like no, a it's one out of two yeah yeah same one out of two it says yep yep why would they build it out of wood when there's a bunch of gas throwing shooting things uh let's see here 
Do you remember so what the command is for sharing? One of these? I mean, we can, we could oh. do that, I guess. I, oh, yeah, it's um. Uh, hold on. Uh, what was it? it? Was like team or? Yeah, I forget what the command is for sharing the, forcing the thing to, share. Uh, cause you have to add them to the party. It's gonna be it oh slash, slash together invite, and then their name. So slash. Um. Nobody wants Bane Arthropods four, right? No. Okay, put that one back. What, what was it, Artie? Uh, slash. Together. Invite, and then their name. Slash together. Invite one word. Uh, no, two words. Together space invite space, space JTX. Name. This invited player already has a team. No, it's we have to do something to synchronize them. Uh, well, when I first logged on, it said synchronizing team. Yeah, but you didn't get the advancement like we did. You should have it. <clears throat> uh. hmm. Well, let's look at slash together. Slash tofu. These oh. scrolls don't give you XP. Oh, slash tofu force sync. Sync. Oh, there you go. Ah, there we go. Oh, jeez. Stop. This thing is made of wood. Go away, you ghasts. Okay, now try. Yeah. All right, so let's go back north again. Let's see if that works. One. Wait, did? Uh, no, it went black again. No, hold on. I think I did this wrong. I think you. I think you guys have to do it. So just type in. I'm gonna type the command into chat. Do force sync, and then do my name. Obviously without the dot. <laughs> I don't think you can do the name. I think you have to do just trophy for sync. Well, that's what I did. You typed your name. It for synced. Yeah, it for synced me to other people. Yep, there they go. So I do for sync and what? I think I think you both might have just gotten it. Try try to go north again. Oh, yeah, um, I'm good now. Yeah, that should have. I don't know what happened there, but I think now you got synced up. All right. Okay. I want these, uh... Woohoo! Oh, there's no... Where is it? Seaweed stuff. Oh, look, Where? a fallen star right above it. I can't see it. Where is it coming from? It's, oh, they're all inside. Okay. They're just destroying everything. All right. I want these uh, vanishing blocks. Can I take them? Probably. A vanishing block? Oh, what yeah, they're reappearing blocks. Yeah, you oh. can make them. They're not breaking, for me anyway. Uh, oh, okay, I found the gas trap on me. Uh, okay, Come, on. Basically go like all the way to the top and then you'll see me there. There's four of them, uh, I think. So Darth, you take that position. Okay, and then Tex, I think that's, yeah, Tex coming right to me. And then you take this position. Yep, yep. Artie, you'll take the west position, and I'll take the oh, north position. Like Ghostbusters or something? West position? Yeah, the west position. So over here. Whatever you do, Tex, don't cross the street. Oh, your guess! Kill it! I don't know why it spawned already, but kill it! Oh, it's crying so many tears. Oh, it's so loud. So yeah, loud. it is very, very loud. Kill it. Oh, that is uncomfortably loud. Get its tears. You can't pick those up. Okay, here's a chest. The Your Gas Trophy is in here. Oh, here's a whole bunch of little gas. Carmenite, Fiery Tears. What is this music? Ow, it's over uh, here with me. These gas are, if you kill stuff, it's going in there. What is this? There's, is there, what, hold on, Trophy, there's a thing for you to look at. What? There's a thing oh, down here. Do I collect no. this? I don't know, but right under where you where the chests are? Yeah. What is this? What is... 
Check it out. I don't oh, know. Thing. Is it a puzzle? Oh, this oh is so these are, these might be um recipes. Let's see here. Can we see carbonite? Oh, is it for the the vanishing blocks? Probably. Yep. Yeah, carbonite reactor, carbonite builder. Yeah, these are recipes for things. Vanishing blocks. Yes, you can craft them. Oh. All right, I have a gas trap. Okay, and then the uh, the com the stuff on the left, the borer essence one, the one with the sparkly powder and stuff. Mm -hmm. I think it's yeah. If you you can use that recipe to make more carbonite. <laughs> Excuse me. Just don't ah. get frozen in it. Ah. <laughs> so, I Star what Wars jokes. All right, let's see here. So, <clears throat> we've killed the your gas now, which I'm taking all this stuff. Let's see here. Wait, what was the one thing that we had to do? There was like we had to kill. The Eurogast, among other things, to go on, didn't we? Uh, I don't know. Oh, Ultimate Showdown. Okay, Ultimate Showdown. Slay the Hydra, Eurogast, and Snow Queen to clear the acid rain and embolden yourself for the Highlands. Find the Lamp of Cinders in the Troll Caves and you can burn away the Thorn Barriers. Uh, okay. So. I'm not entirely sure what we're looking for. Um. Yes, trap. Okay, wait, are we, are you, let's farm up on me, farm up on Jogo above. Do you get the other gas trap, Artie? Yep. All right. I can't break these vanishing blocks. All right, I can make them though, so that's fine. Oh, 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 can't fly, all right. All right, so I got three gas traps. There should have been four. Yeah, Artie's got one. Let me okay, throw cool. this nether rack on Choco. Alright, let me see if Okay, so let's head due west southwest. Uh or you want us to go northwest like you? No, west southwest. Uh okay. On my map it looked like you were going Yeah, I just I was curious about something. I wanted to check something. Ah. What is that? Okay. Oh, it's a little village. Is it the one with the witch? Oh, wait. That's where we started. What? Is that me? Yeah, that's the giant thing. Remember I was saying there was a, a me there? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Wait, where's everyone else? Oh. There's a me. Okay, um. so... Yeah, so um, I see me there. I'm at some broken up little island thing. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's the one. I don't think it's the one they're at, but it's the same thing. Oh yeah. I'm by you, Choco now. I do yeah, like I that see tower Darth, I see Tex. Um X negative five Z two two two. Okay, I was just with you, so Yeah, I see a I bunch of that. really large Chocos. Oh, I, I see a No, giant they're big Durs. I think for each and of I... us, they're different. It's our worst nightmares. Why is it still raining? I have acid rain. Oh. Are y'all up higher or down low? Hold on. I'm on the island. Like, we're, we're right next to you, Tex. It's raining, but it's not acid rain. No, give me a sec. Maybe that's it. Oh, the island's up top. Okay. Can I take this fluffy cloud? I want this too. <laughs> I can. No, we ransacking the place. Oh, there's some me's. Yep. Can I kill the me's? No, uh, I can't. I can't. Ah! Cloud. Yeah, let's I go ahead. And, I'm yeah, sorry. I'm sorry. It's fine. It's fine. Go ahead and Are kill him. Are we em. killing this? Yep. Kill We're em. killing ourselves? Yep. You know. I look so peaceful, though. Look. Look at that. Look at that. I was just a friendly guy. <laughs> I was just minding my How own business. Look? <laughs> That is awesome. <laughs> uh, Alright, Durth's new weapon. Give me a sec, I gotta ransack. Can I hit you with it? Let's see. Wispy Cloud, 
Wispy Cloud. Oh, I can't pick it up. Shears, maybe? <gasps> shears, maybe. Let me try shears. Nope. You know, Here, it's really it hard to... Uh, everywhere? Well, Hello. Jerth. What you wanted to get? Here, I'll get it for you. I wanted Fluffy Cloud. But if I try to break it... No, I got you here. I got so, Fluffy Cloud. So what's all I this can't walk junk underneath, it. then? Oh, there we go. Yeah, what is with all this junk, then? Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> don't, don't, don't waste the pickaxe. Oh no, my pickaxe. Uh, okay. Here, fluffy cloud. Yep, I got some. All right. Find, I'll leave part of the island. Find the lamp of cinders in the troll caves, and you can burn away the thorn barriers. I mean, I do yeah, have a cave troll in front of me, who apparently can hit me quite hard. Wait, where are you at? Uh, I'm underneath you guys. This is where we died Tex. previously. Tex, take some of this oh, giant yeah. cobblestone and stuff for, uh, so we we can uh, make houses out of it. <laughs> <laughs> There's this giant block well, of obsidian. I think you guys might need to use like the big, the giant's uh, yeah, pickaxe. Yeah, you do. Don't just oh. so don't waste the pickaxe. When, when I broke it. the uh, when I broke the cobblestone, it just broke into a bunch of little cobblestone. I think. Yeah, I'm it. wondering if like the obsidian thing is like hiding something. Yeah. Come, come down, break it. All right, we hang on. Big... I'm on my way down. We need giant obsidian. Huh. All, All right. right. Don't vein mine. Where are you guys at? <sighs> right underneath. underneath. Literally underneath. Okay. Uh, that is an no to iron the middle. Pick. That's an iron pick. Iron. No, he's using. It's the giant's pick. It should work, I think. It does. Because like, if I'm trying to mine it with my pick, it's zero percent. But it looks like his is. Yeah, it's going. Yeah. So as long as it's going, it's fine. Oh look, it's a normal little block. Break. <laughs> Keep going. Don't give up. Here it goes. Oh. Anything else? Ah! Oh, chests. Uh... Oh, I'm saying. Trap chests. Torch berries. Oh, magic Sitting. beans. Like the one that Tex had. Oh. Yeah, a lamp of cinders. Uberus oh, soil? Troll. Wait, is this the it? same chest as me. Find the lamp of cinders in the troll caves. Oh, this was, this was the lamp of cinders. Who has the lamp? Oh. I've got it. Okay. Here, let me give it to somebody more responsible. Oh, no, uh, you, you hold on to it. It's your job now. No. Okay, this fine. is your life now. Did it drop a giant piece of obsidian? No. no it's it just, just like shatters. Regular. That'd be that's, awesome. If it is. That's messed up. I really wanted a giant piece of obsidian. Right, I gotta go kill the skeleton because I'm still working on skeletons. Should I kill it... the... Uh, should I kill the troll? No, we got the lamp of cinders. We got what we needed. I've like got some blue just, wool too. I don't know if we needed that. I mean, he's just existing over there. Like, <laughs> fine. Go go ahead and kill him. What is this? What is what? Huge mushroom. Yeah, it's like. It's, I think it's just like a whole bunch of things that are. I think something here got broken. I think something went horribly, horribly wrong here. I think there's supposed to be something, but it just kind of broke. Uh, However, this is a good chance to get mushrooms. I suppose so. So. All right. Uh, Tex, I think we have to head towards those weird tower things. So, we just got the Lamp of Cinders, and we have to go burn away the Thorn Barrier. Wait, wasn't the Thorn Barrier, like, in, like, a wooded area? Isn't it, like, a weird dark wood thing? Uh, don't know. Here, let's just, let's try to make our way towards the thing that's west. Like, the big structures. East. Yes. These towers. Can we take these blocks? I want some of them. Oh, look at that. Oh yeah, yeah. Tex. You see? Oh, so you see that little green stuff on the side of these towers? Yeah. I yeah, think those are the thorns that you you're gonna need. Thing. You're gonna need to break it with your um lamp. So let's all stay together with Tex. All right. It's like super buggy and laggy. It looks this like cactus looking stuff. Yeah, that cactus looking stuff. But don't well, don't. 
Okay, let's there's let's go a... fly up a little bit. Because right, there's a whole bunch of them over there on that tower over there. Yeah, I might. I don't know like what we're trying to do, but let's uh, fly up a little bit. Because I don't want to. I don't. Is there a durability on their text? Do you know? Uh, no. It, doesn't. it does. It, do, it does take it when you use it, I believe. I want one of these castle doors Ooh. too. Oh, oh, yeah. I'm oh, you, the door closed on me. Yeah, just right click on it. Oh, there's something down here. Harbinger cube. Aha! Die, Harbinger cube. Okay, that was kind of anticlimactic. Uh. I can take the doors. Oh, nice. These poor oh. things. Oh. Oh, oh, over here. There's there's some weird wooden uh cage. Uh. It's southwest of your guys' position, already in Tex. Southwest? Yeah. Uh. Hold on, coming to you. Yeah, just said, yep, there you go. Ooh, what are these? I want, can I, can Final I boss here. You win. You can join the Twilight Forest Discord. Oh. Ha! What? That's right. Twilight Forest never actually completed. Um. <laughs> it never completed, and that's the final thing. I don't think they expect anybody to actually win or beat it. That's weird. Yeah, this is where the final boss would have gone if they had actually continued on. Huh. Alright, I'm gonna yep. take more of these doors. I don't want these. Can I have these runes? Yeah, you can break them down. Then what was the point of the thorn? Oh, I guess if, like, we're going, if we were just like legging it from the bottom. It would have been something that would have been necessary. Okay, I got a bunch of runes here somehow. Uh, well. I don't think I like this. I, no, I really feel like this was a really strange. Like I get like that they made like a compact version of it for Sky Factory, but like this just felt weird. It felt like a really, really not so well done version of it. Yeah. It's weird because it's it's so compact. This is actually the normal adherent. Thing, well, but the thing is, like, because it's in the sky, it presumes that we have flight. I think. Right. But if you have flight, we just flew to the top, found the boss, and beat it to death, and then we just leave. There's like weird hey. Tron people living inside of here. You stole my doors. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'll give them back to you. No, no, I'm no, no. Fighting you can keep them. adherents. <laughs> It's so dark in here. Yeah, there's nothing but stairs down here, Dirk. No, I can't. Be, so we can't make this rune block. So loot all you can take. It's really cool looking. But it's yep, just... I'm 100% taking all of it. Well. Alright, well, anyways. For those of you who are watching on YouTube, I think that's a pretty good place to end. We did manage to win, I guess. I'm not entirely sure if we did actually win, but... It, we did, we yeah. solved the problem, we solved the puzzle, we got through the acid ring, we stopped all that, we beat all the bosses that existed. Um, we do have the questing ram, but I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna wait until we have all the dyes from Miss Agriculture, and then we'll worry about the, the questing ram. And there are a couple of other things here and there, sorry for the enderman noise, but there are a couple things here and there that uh, we could do, like we still have, the different like troll caves or whatever the twilight the hollow hills that's what they're called so we have some hollow hills that we can go do we have the questing ram um we we could collect all the food from twilight i guess i don't really know what the point of that would be um there is the weird mystery meat one which i'm not entirely sure equipment based ones which i don't really think are really worth doing but i guess we could theoretically do that if we really wanted to um I think that's it. I think that's all there there really is here to go for it. And I think at this point, it would be probably advisable before I just write this whole thing off. Let me make sure that there's no items that look really, really useful here. Ore meter, what's an ore meter? Well, can't get it. Uh, ch -ch -ch -ch. Okay, so we got, we got the Naga Trophy, Twilight Lich, Hydra, 
Urgas, Knight, Snow Queen, and Mana Shroom. The Questing Ram is the only trophy that we need. Uh, so a bunch of equipment stuff. Transformation powder, I don't know what that is. It's, oh, we can get the block and chain as an actual weapon? Weird. Talisman. So is there any point to the light I have then? The cinder? The lamp? The lamp, yeah. Well, if we yeah, were walking us, up, we, it would be useful, yeah. Wait. I haven't ever... The uncrafting table's in here. Yep. Isn't that like super OP? Depends. Can't you do like really weird things with the uncrafting table? If you get an item that you normally can't craft, you can get what would have made it. But what's that do for you? Because it's you can't craft it. Huh. Okay, I'll I'll do some research on that. I vaguely remember that there was like some really stupid things that you could do with uncrafting tables, but I can't quite remember. All right, well, uh, th for those of you who are watching on YouTube, thank you for watching. If you did enjoy, consider leaving a like rating down below. Subscribe to the channel if you are new, and if you would like to go ahead and hit the notification bell so you can be notified, then by all means, please do. Uh, in terms of where we're... So we finished off Twilight Forest. I think Artie's going to be ransacking the whole place, but... I don't have to be right now. I mean. Yeah, I, I, I don't think I'm going to be really worrying about ransacking a whole lot. Uh, I don't know what Dirt's and Tex's opinions are about the whole thing, but I'm done with Twilight Forest. I'm already ransacking. Oh, okay. <laughs> Dirt, are you ransacking as well? I took some just to help Artie out. I didn't really want it myself. Gotcha. All right, so people are going to ransack and loot because, you know, we're looters. And I think we're just about then all good to go. So we have, we do technically have one trophy left to go um, if we wanted to be like really completionist -y about it, which who knows, potentially, we might we might consider doing that. I'm not quite sure yet. But uh, yeah, other than that, I think we're in pretty good shape. We got ourselves some other magic beans, kind of neat. Um, I have no idea what I can use with like half the other stuff that we found, but eh, you know, it's fine. But uh, yeah. In terms of the next episode, I think we're going to go back to kind of working on the home front again because we, we are at the point now where we really should be thinking about automation and um, getting the machines properly hooked up and connected and whatever else. We aren't quite like ultra resource rich, but we're, we're going to be getting there pretty darn soon. Um, so yeah, that is it. And then anything anyone needs to add? Um, I may or may not have just dropped the lamp into the void. That's alright, we can get another one. Yeah, we can get another one. <laughs> nah, I don't think we needed it anyways. Yeah, the thorn... It I mean, there's flu. no boss there anyway, so who knows. But, anywho, alright, thank you all very much for watching. If you, of course, also, if you'd like to check out Dirth or Tex's perspectives, so you can watch Tex throw the lamp out and get the <laughs> criminal evidence that actually will lead to us having concrete cases against him. Feel free to do that. <laughs> and Dirth's, uh, Dirth, I am incredibly disturbed by the little Dirth that sits above your head, to be honest. Why? I don't know. It just weirds me out. Why am I, per why am I glowing green? What was, why do I have green potion effects going on? Uh, Dirth, put away know. the large sword. I just want to test it. <laughs> Fine. Go there's, ahead. Well, there's a slime right there. Nothing happened. <laughs> What? You took a heart. No. Oh, wait, did I? Yeah, I did. Yep. Go ahead, the slime. Well, before I dropped the uh, the thing, it did um, Dirt, hit the slime. burn one of the green things. I don't want to hit the slime. I'll Make him it. kill himself. I'll do it for science. It works. It's a sword. <laughs> All right. Craft had that big birth of... Yeah, we got that beat. <laughs> <laughs> all right well Giant stone sword thank you all for watching again and as always and most importantly take care of yourself a wonderful safe day and until next time ciao for now. Now. later guys <laughs>